So yesterday being Monday, one of the things that we talked about was getting with our, our staff and saying, hey, where, do you, where might you want to be in five years? So I, I actually set up three chairs yesterday, and, I, and the first chair is like the chair of what do you want? Where do you want to go? And today I want to hit, talk about what I, we, we talked about yesterday on the second chair. It's like the second chair is are you coachable? So yesterday we were like, what might you want to be doing in five years? What type of work might you be doing in the company? And you can watch yes, yesterday's video. But today I want to talk about the second step, the second chair, which is are you coachable? Are you somebody that is willing to be coached? What I said to my staff yesterday is you might not want me to coach you, but is it fair to say that it's likely that you're going to need somebody to coach, mentor, help you achieve what you want to achieve within the next five years? Is it likely that you're going to need somebody to mentor or coach you? Can you get there by yourself? Maybe. Um, but what if you can't? What if you need a coach? Now, you don't need me to be your coach, but you need somebody to be your coach. And so are you coachable? Like, are you somebody that are like, all right, here's very specific things that we identified yesterday, things that I want, Kyron, right? Things that very specific things I want. And then are you coachable? Are you somebody that, which we'll talk about feedback tomorrow, but are you somebody that, um, that is willing to submit? Oh my gosh, that's such a cuss word, right? Submit to somebody else's uh, authority and or encouragement, right? Which we'll talk about tomorrow. But again, like, are you, are you somebody that is willing to help have others uh, provide insight, feedback that they believe is going to help you achieve what you said you want to achieve, right? For me to be your coach, I need to know where you're going. What do you, what do you want? And I've talked to our staff about this. It's like, you know, from a coaching standpoint, if you help enough other people get what they want, you're going to get what you want, right? We've heard those, those statements, but they're true, right? So if I take my staff, we currently have 27 guys and gals. If I actually have my leadership team focus on those 27 guys and gals and help them get what they want, we coach them up, right? Help them achieve the success they want to achieve. What's the result that's likely to be for my leaders and myself, right? It, and so it's like that second, what's first is them, what's second is me. That, that's my mode of which, again, I'll, I'll do a deeper dive tomorrow. But um, you have to ask yourself as one of my teammates is, are you coachable? Are you somebody that is open to coaching? And if the answer is yes, because I, you know, going back to seat one is what do I want? Seat two is, are you coachable, right? Are you coachable to feedback, insight, perspectives that those coaching you think are going to help propel you to the objectives that you want, right? What's the lifestyle that you want? What's the job that you want? What are the things that you want? And you can change your mind, Kyron. You can change your mind. What are some of the things that you want? And then are you open to coaching? Super excited to talk tomorrow about feedback because that's one of the ingredients. It's, you know, it's a secret sauce.